Welcome to Real Kiwi Fishing. This week, I'm back out off the beach. What we've done is we've driven up Mirawai. So we're gonna spend the day up the end of Mirawai. Fishing a spot that I don't normally fish. Normally fish the beach, but we've come around the corner and hit, gonna have a shot here. They catch a lot of trevally, snapper and gurnard here. So um, we'll see how we go. I'd say those summer months, sort of that January, February, March would be good here. And probably that late evening or early morning. It's quite shallow. Um, so not too sure if the snapper are going to come in here this sort of time of the day but um, hey I'd rather be out getting the line wet anyway but uh, we'll see how we go hopefully get into a few fish and hopefully you enjoy my sister's hooked up and it looks like it's a stingray get a lot of stingrays here obviously in the uh, harbour Jen's hooked up. Looks like it might be a car why. Tides, tides coming in and we're just starting to get bites. It's taking a while. Jen's hooked up again. I just got a strike on my rod. Not sure, it might be another car way. Maybe Trevally. Geez, they're big car way. This one feels a little bit like a trevally maybe. You do catch trevally here. So let's hope we've caught something different in Kawai. Got the breakers breaking right on the lip out there. You just gotta be real careful that the fish doesn't come off right where it's breaking feels like a yeah uh, it does feel like a bit of a trevally maybe it's once again it's great not to know up here on the west coast it's a lot of fun even if you're um wanting snapper and they're not here at least you're um there's fish here to catch feels a bit different than the car while we've been catching I think it's a nice big trevally and it is nice big trevally Big Trevally, West Coast Trevally. Jen's hooked up again. There's a lot of car wire here, which is a bit annoying, but that's what you get in the harbour a lot of. 
and quite big too a lot of fun for her as well so that's what today was mainly about I was really just coming up here having a go and um, getting the sis out into some fish and the great thing is is it doesn't have to be snapper for her to enjoy the day out catching fish but uh, tide's still rising hopefully um, the snapper might turn up on that higher tide just never know might be a big snapper Jen's hooked up again. Not too sure what it is. Could be a big uh, stingray. Was fighting there, but sometimes they actually feel like fish when you're fighting them. I think the line sort of cuts across their wings. just never know with the west coast could even be a big trevally or a big snapper but I would say with a run like that a stingray <laughs> just let it pull Say it's a big stingray. She's having a lot of fun, that's for sure. Even if it is a stingray, stingray and kawai. <laughs> Might be a big shark. She's hooked up hardcore. I'd say it's a big stingray. The weird thing is it's sort of just straight out. Where stingrays normally sort of run parallel with their bank. But um, the size of the runs. Here it goes again. I'd say it's a big stingray but you just never know. That's the great thing about fishing up here on the west coast. You can't pick what you've got. She's still at it. It's been about 10 minutes. It might even be, if we're lucky, a kingfish. Which um, obviously can happen, especially up here on the coast not unheard of but it's still coming across as a stingray use that wave there he is it's a, it's a kingy it's a kingfish just use the waves use the waves Walk down. She's hooked up to a kingfish. What a battle. What a battle. What a battle she's had. It's a kingfish. It's a nice one too. 
Use the waves. It's a good size. <laughs> what a battle! Wait for those waves. He's a big fish. Look at that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Solid kingfish off the sand. Surf casting yes up there. Okay, push him off, push him forward, see if he'll go. Yep, let him go. Okay. He'll be right. Okay. Yeah, he'll be right. Once he gets a bit of water. It's a nice fish. So he must have been close to, I'd say, 20 kilo. It's around that 18. Yeah. A lot of in it. Nice. Hopefully, it's a snapper. Haven't caught one as yet, but it's starting to feel like another Trevally. Oh, it's gone. Hooked up. Caught another species. Looks like a nice gurnard. It's a pretty decent gurnard too. There you go. How's that? Kawai, Trevally, Kingfish, and now Gurnard. All we need is a couple of snapper to turn up. Or a few more of these. Well, that's pretty much it for us for today. It's been an awesome day. Basically fished from low to low. Fish really came on the bite through that high tide, but there was quite a big swell rolling. But uh, we'll definitely be back up here, have another shot. It's quite a long sort of stretch to fish. And I just want to try and find out where it's a little bit deeper maybe, deeper channel or a hole. It's quite shallow out in front of us. But obviously through that high tide, it gets deeper, fish come in. But yeah, awesome, awesome day. And um, even though we didn't get onto the snapper, it's always quite um, nice to actually do something different. It'd be nice to catch a snapper or two, but you know, we've got a gurnard there, um, a few tr um, trevally and kawai, so been an awesome uh, day. But yeah, we'll call it a day, and hopefully you guys enjoyed, and uh, we definitely did. Till next time, tight lines. Thanks for watching another great day out fishing with Real Kiwi Fishing. And you can also find more of my movies on my YouTube channel, Real Kiwi Fishing.